okay just to show what Aeroflight's supposed to look like that will shoot this arrow with 145 grain point uh, bear shaft this is 45 pound bears uh, super Kodiak so this should should shoot well I've, I've signed it up for the 216 and I'm shooting uh, 200 grain point but this is a 1916 so let's see what this does all right I'll over knock. I can shoot this straight up man I'll over knock and lock push away grip come to the center lock stir the target ready one two one That's a little bit knock left. Try it again. One, two, three. Two, three. <laughs> yeah. Probably could go down even a little bit in point weight. I'm going to stick a 125 on there and see what that does. When you look at how bales are stacked and layered, sometimes when your arrow hits even at an angle, it'll try to turn it the other way. So you have to be perfectly perpendicular. So let me try this again. Still 145, bear shaft tune. No, I'm, yeah, 145 point, 1916, bear super Kodiak. Here we go, ready? One, two, three, dart! Mm -hmm. All right, bear shaft tune, 145 grain point, 1916, bear super Kodiak. Here we go. Center lungs, throw the target. Ready? One, two, three. Two, three. Still a bit knocked left. Let me try 125. All right, bear shaft tune, 45 pound pull, 120 grave grain point, 1916. Over not long, which way grip. The center lost there at the target, ready? One, two, three. Two. <laughs> <laughs> Heck yeah, dang, that was perfect. There you go. <laughs> all right this is about a 450 grain arrow 45 pound pull bear super kodiak trying to get a chronograph on it cut ready One. 139 yep that's probably about right and that flew like a dart there you go. Mm-hmm.